Okay, today we will be um, testing the output of a standard three-wire speed sensor. Uh, we've got the autometer 5291 here, uh, though this will all uh, be consistent for uh, any other three-wire style speed senders. Um, so we will need a voltmeter, which we will set to DC voltage, uh, which is what the bulk of your automotive electrical testing will need. Uh, now the important thing with these is we need to move this as slowly as possible. Um, as you can see here, as I turn this very slowly, and you can actually hear it on the meter, uh, we get an open and then closed sigma. Okay, if we were doing this in real life uh, on the vehicle, we would have the key on and we would ever so slowly be inching the wheels around. Uh, that on off shows us that we are getting a good signal. Now, uh, if we hook this up to a drill, you can see on the meter here what higher speeds will show us. Uh, there's no on off. Obviously, the meter can't sample quick enough as it starts to slow down, though. We will start to get that open and closed again. Uh, we can test for this at the back of the speedo and at the sending unit itself uh, using the drive wheels and then turning it manually with a drive key to verify exactly where the problem may exist. So that's how we test a three-wire sending unit.